Welcome back everyone. I'll go and show you exactly how to screen record on any Samsung Galaxy S22 out there. It's a very, very easy process. Now to do this, what you want to do is you want to start off by scrolling down on your taskbar up top and you want to scroll down one more time. And when you get here, you'll basically get into your little, you know, toggle situation here where you can go ahead and, you know, modify your quick toggles. So if you go ahead and kind of scroll through here, you'll see a couple of different options that come up, but all you want to do is look for the screen recorder toggle. So you'll see the screen recorder toggle right here for me. If I swipe to the side, I can also click the plus button here. You may be able to find that screen recorder toggle up here. And if you do that, all you want to do is drag it down here and you'll basically be able to get that toggle. All you want to do is be able to see this toggle like that. And that's all you really need to do. Now what you want to do is you want to hold this toggle down like this and you'll get into your screen recorder options. Now you can go ahead and modify this however you want to. If you want the video quality to be higher, lower, you can change that here. The screenshot to all these things you can go and kind of scroll through here and modify what you want. Now when everything is set, all you want to do is scroll down once more, scroll down once more, and you want to hit the screen recording toggle and you want to go ahead and configure this however you want to. Do you want no sound, media sounds, media sounds, and mic? You can go and configure that. If you want to show your taps and touches, you can, con you can configure that as well. Now, if we click start recording, it'll count down from three. And at this point, you can go ahead and do whatever you want to. You'll see this tab bar up top. It's not going to be there in the recording. So you can go ahead and really use your phone as you normally would. Whenever you're done, you can go and either click the pause button or the stop button. In this case, we'll just click the stop button and it'll say recording has been saved. So now all we have to do is make our way over to our gallery application like this. And you will see, I don't know why I closed out of it, that we will have that screen recording that we just made right here. So we can go ahead and open it up and it'll go ahead and be that full on screen recording that we just made. And that's really the process. That's really all we have to do. It's that simple. There's really not much else we have to go with it. And at this point, you can go ahead and share it out. You can edit it up. You can delete it if you want to, but that's pretty much the process. If you guys have any other questions or anything, let me know in the comment section below. Hit the like button, that would mean so much, but definitely hit that subscribe button. More importantly than everything else, I love every single one of you guys. Hopefully I'll catch you guys in the next video. Peace out till then.